Hello everyone, this is Tim from Premium Tutor. I'm here to talk about one frequently asked question from 2018 AP Calculus BC official exam, which is the one you can see here on the screen. So let's just dive right into the question. If the power series converges at x equals 7 and diverges at x equals 9, which of the following must be true? We're given three statements. Statement 1 says the series converges at x equals 1, and for statement 2 it says it converges at x equals 2, and for the number 3 it says the series diverges at x equals negative 1. So according to the question you can see the power series uh, it is a n times x minus 4 to the power of n, which means this power series ex is expanded at x equals 4. So x equals 4 is the middle point here. And don't forget, the interval of convergence is symmetric with respect to the middle point, which is 4. So when this says the series is convergent at x equals 7, we can see at least the radius of convergence would be 7 minus 4, which is 3. So the radius convergent is at least equal to 3. And then it says it is divergent at x equals 9, which means the radius convergent is at most 9 minus 4, which is equal to 5. So this is uh, the range of the radius of convergent. It is at least 3 and it is at most 5. So let's examine the statements. Number 1, it says the series converges at x equals 1. So we can see it is actually possible um, that if the middle point is 4 and if it is convergent at 7, then it's possible that the series is not convergent at 1. So we can eliminate statement 1, number 2. The series converges at x equals 2 uh, because the radius of convergent is at least 3 and x equals 2 is included in the interval of convergent. So statement 2 is correct. And move on to statement number 3. The series diverges at x equals negative 1. Um, in this case, we said the radius convergence is at most 5, which is 9 minus 4. So it is convergent, uh, it is divergent here, which means it could be possible that the series is convergent at x equals negative 1 if the radius of convergence is equal to 5, because 4 minus 5 is equal to negative 1, which means statement 3 is also wrong. So the correct answer of this question is B.